Hi everyone, thanks for following my page, Meals, Deals, and Keeping It Real. As I said before, I have the two products that I'm going to compare the laundry stain sticks. So right here I have OxyClean Max Force Pre-Treater Gel Stick. And then over here I have the Spray and Wash First Time Stain Removal. So I put an O on the shirt for the OxyClean. I have um, some things we're going to put on the shirt here. And an S over here for the spray and wash. I've got some jelly, some chocolate syrup, and some ketchup that we are going to put on the shirts and then treat them with the stain sticks. First one I'm going to do is the OxyClean Max Force. I'm going to treat the jelly. I'm actually, this has a um, tip to it where it's, you can work it into the fabric with this. So I'm just going to put a couple pumps on the jelly. And try my best to work this out. This is the best case scenario. I'm treating it right away. Stain just happened and I'm treating it right away. So we will see. Okay. I'm going to come over here to the chocolate syrup. Got quite a bit on this one. come back to that one and treat it again. Um, down here we have the ketchup and I'm really pumping out quite a bit of this on here. Okay, let's try some on this pen. I'm going to come back in with this cloth. Perhaps I'm going to put my cloth in just a little bit of water that I have here. Chocolate doesn't want to budge. I'm going over the jelly. I got a little bit of water. So I've really scrubbed this jelly the best I can. Okay, so now I'm going to move over to this spray and wash. Um, this one I've never used before. The OxyClean I have and I usually get pretty good results on it but um, it also depends on what the stain is and how long that stain has sat on that shirt or pants before I treat it. So this one I've never used before so this is brand new to me as well. Doesn't really have much of an odor to it. Twists up like a deodorant would. I almost dare say it's odorless. This one has a really good, the OxyClean has a good smell to it. This one, there's a hint of something, but it's just, it's not, um, it's not strong. So, I'm treating the jelly. In case you're wondering, you can probably figure out, I put the, um, letters on there in permanent marker. They're not going anywhere. So I'm rubbing this onto the jelly. I'm 
I can feel that it is going very quickly. As I press down on it. Um, let's try the chocolate. This is let's try the chocolate now. down to the ketchup. I'm just going to put it up a little bit. I don't... Alright. And let's do the pen. I'm just going to say you can see a difference already between these two and see the pen's not budging the pen budged over here the pens I'm out of breath from doing this it's not budging look at the difference in the chocolate there's a difference in all of them and this is going like extremely quickly too I can't see this lasting too long at least not in our house I'm gonna try one more time over here and I'm gonna scrub it with the cloth as well so let's do this jelly I am scrubbing. Oh. I dare say it looks like that jelly came out. And I can still see it sitting over here. Okay. know that's not we'll see it's lifting it's definitely lifting I'm really putting some work into this um, and then this last one I'm going to treat down here is the ketchup and then this is going into the washer and then I will show you guys the results when it comes out of the washer I think I'm going to show you the results when it comes out of the washer and then when it comes out of the dryer too. Um, I'm dipping this in water and then I'm re-scrubbing and that's really lifting too. Oops, let's try this pen. I haven't found anything that will take pen out yet. If you get pen on a, on a shirt it's a goner pretty much. So there's that. Um, as you can see, they did lift, but I don't know. So when I wash, we wash with um, Purex with OxyClean in it. And I will show you the wet results when it comes out of the washer. And then again, when it comes out of the dryer. Hi everyone, so I'm back. The shirt just came out of the washer. Um, like I said, I washed it with Purex with oxyclean and in hot water I'm shocked at the results so the jelly is gone from both of them the chocolate stain is still there on both sides but I hope you can see it's much lighter over on this side than it is on this side and then the ketchup is gone the pen's still there on both sides but I did notice some of the permanent marker faded over on this side too so, so far, I'm in favor of this over here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to just treat them one more time quickly. And then I'm going to, I'm going to wash them one more time um, to see if it's going to take the chocolate and any of the permanent marker and pen out. But I didn't think that this was going to happen. I truly thought that this side over here, spray and wash, um wasn't really going to produce any results. I don't know why I thought that. I just did. So let me scrub these for just a second here.
I'm dipping this in warm water. My rag here. And I'm scrubbing it real quick before I put it back in hot water wash again. Why would you do that? Unexpected. What are you going to do? I'm keeping it real. So now we're getting broccoli off because some men in the house are immature. So let's try this. I'm screaming on the inside. All right. You know what? Now we're getting broccoli off as well. So now we get to see the results on this. Now you get to keep your room. Uh -huh. I can't believe you did that. All right. Here we go. This is going back in. Broccoli stains too. And I'll get back in touch with you guys. So this is fresh out of the washer. As you can see, there's t still about two spots on there that you can see. Um, however, so the permanent marker faded over on this side with the spray and wash. There is no jelly on either side. There's a little bit more chocolate, chocolate over here than you can see over here. And then I just see just a little bit of ketchup. It's just a little fade over here and I don't see any ketchup over here. I wanna note that the broccoli that was thrown on my shirt was roasted broccoli so it had a little bit of oil on it, okay? And those marks I scrubbed with this and I don't see any grease stains on this shirt. So let's talk about a blessing in disguise. So this is your winner this is what i will go with for now on and if you have another stain stick maybe the tide stick or another one um, any other suggestions if you want to see another comparison then leave it in the comments